So I have been trying to film this video application all week now. I tried to wake up early and get some really cool shots around my city of Milwaukee. I tried to show you some of my background by going to the first lecture hall I ever had a college course in. But everything that I was producing seemed disingenuine, and I'm hoping that by just sitting down in front of this camera, I can answer some of the questions that were asked of me, and that I produce something that I am more proud of putting out into the world. So, hi, I'm Jake. Um, I am 24 years old, and I currently live in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I saw a posting for a job with To Write Love on Her Arms, and I've always really been connected to this mission. Um, to Write Love on Her Arms was always around when I was growing up. They were at all of the Warp tours. They were connected to all of these bands that I used to listen to, and it was really one of the first messages I heard about being kind to yourself, protecting your mental health, and being able to really just explore who you are. Um, I felt very stifled growing up in a small community that I felt like my complete journey of a human being didn't start until I was in college. But To Write Love on Her Arms was one of those voices that I kept hearing that told me to keep going. So I think it would be really great if I could contribute to something that's had such a big impact in my life. Um, and it's really great to see that there are positions open like a graphic designer where I can help create branded materials. Uh, creating branding materials is one of my favorite things to do. I have a degree from the University of Wisconsin-Milwaukee in journalism, advertising, and public relations. Uh, so I got to know a lot of the planning side of things. And then um, I went a little bit further and took courses within our School of the Arts to learn and hone my skills in graphic design. I currently work at the University of Wisconsin-Milwaukee as a communication specialist for the Office of Undergraduate Admissions, where I am typically in charge of making sure that our branding is consistent across campus to every communication to undergraduate students. So I um, am collecting pieces from different campus partners and making sure that they are consistent with the UW-Milwaukee message. One of my most proud moments in my professional career is when I got to help plan Panther Fest. Boy, I'm doing good. How about you? Panther Fest is a concert series that we hold for the UW-Milwaukee students every year to welcome them to or back to campus. Uh, in 2017, I sat as the artist selection chair. Uh, so I had a group of a few students and myself collecting data, uh, looking at budgets, connecting to performers, and we eventually booked our show. Uh, we ended up booking Kiara, Mr. Wives, and Kyle. Previously to working for UW-Milwaukee and helping plan Panther Fest, I was the editorial intern at Alternative Press Magazine. I was able to learn how to post real-time news articles. I was writing articles on breaking news as quickly as I could to get them out. Uh, and then every once in a while, I would get an opportunity to write as a feature writer as well. I would say that I'm more interested in design work, and one of my favorite aspects in design work is that you get to watch all of these ideas in your brain come together as a visualized piece, and it's really exciting to see what you're capable of, and I love to watch that process. My biggest dream is to run a large-scale music event or festival. Um, I want it to be based heavily in local culture and promote local businesses, but also call in a large audience from all over that can come enjoy the headlining acts. In the meantime, 
of me wanting to pursue that dream. I am looking to hone and build my skills in businesses that have an effect on me and also affect the community as well. But my biggest fear is that I am going to become complacent in mediocrity. Um, I'm afraid that I'm going to get too comfortable where I currently am in my life and just keep doing the same old, same old every day. And I want to make sure that I'm constantly growing and evolving as a human being. But finally, I think I'd be a good addition to the team at To Write Love on Her Arms because I have been connected to this message. I think I would be a great addition to the To Write Love on Her Arms team because I've been connected to this message for such a long time. And as I've been growing my professional skills now that I have graduated college, I am really hoping that I can contribute to something that's changed my life in my formative years, as well as continue to grow and build my skills. So I know that this video isn't some big crazy production, um, and instead it's just me sitting on my living room floor and talking and answering some questions, but I thought that putting out this would be a more genuine idea of who I am as an applicant. And I really hope I can hear back from you soon. Uh, if you have any questions, my contact information is listed in the email uh, that I sent over. I hope you enjoyed the email. Uh, I worked really hard on creating a resume in HTML code uh, that could be sent out via email. So uh, please click around. There are plenty of hyperlinks in it to link you to some of my work or some of my clips that are floating around the internet. Um, but I really hope to hear back from you soon. So thanks for listening. Bye.